Hello everyone, it's Lorraine and today I'm coming to you with some more gift mail. Um, this was sent to me by um, a friend of mine, Amy Holner, Adelita. Um, I, she was one of the ones that um, I was on the hunt for the, um, the Wet n Wild Mega Last I don't know, limited edition collection and as a thank you she sent me a gift and I think I hear candy. I feel like Garfield on those, the car cartoons where he'd be like, ooh, candy, 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 candy. I just love candy. I know I need to stop, but oh, it's, ouch. Oh, wow, these are really, your tape just really good. <clears throat> I thought I peeled it all the way off, but I was trying not to break a nail. Okay, there we go. Oh, I missed some tape. Don't you hate when that happens? So, um, again, um, just a thank you gift from her. Um, so let's see. Ooh. And this is what it looks like on the inside. Ooh. Oh, and I've never heard of these. Never seen these polishes, some of these. And someone had just asked me about these. That's what's so, it's so funny. Um, so the first thing on top is this. This is very, very cute. I've never seen these either. LA Girls, oh, I'm sorry, LA Colors Flash Pop. It's a dual nail polish um, with some glitter polish. And it is a pink, like a very nice bright pink. It looks brighter. It doesn't look as bright on the viewfinder but it is pretty bright and then some really nice really pretty glitter and I'm trying to see if there's a name oh fireworks well that's fitting and um i just wanted to test that this is it won't fit in the polish shaker it's too slim like the hard candy polish and then the next thing she sent me which you can never have too much of is cuticle oil by in enrogen and that's what it looks like. So I will definitely be putting this. Um, I don't have one in my car as of now. I have one pretty much everywhere else, everywhere else but not in my car. And she got me some Mike and Nikes. Oh, love, love, love Mike and Nikes. And then the one thing, I don't think I've, I've never seen any of these. Oh, Broadway nails um I, i've heard of broadway nails just because they always have those little um like acrylic nail kits and nail kits art kits at walmart and walgreens but i didn't know they have nail polish now I'm, I'm assuming they're the same brand but i could be wrong this is a high shine nail polish and this one is called mr right nail and this is right up my alley i love this blue this is absolutely stunning and um, this is a standard size, 0. 0.5 um, ounces. So again, Mr. Right Now. And I don't know if you'll be able to. There we go, Mr. Right Now. And she got me another one. This one is like a, is a coral color one. And this one is called Flamingo. This one is stunning as well. I came with the Chardis to see how well they apply. And then the rest of these are by Santi. And they're Sand Texture Nail Polish. And I've never heard of this um, brand before. And I've never ever seen these bottles ever. And this one is called Memory Lane. And this one is has holographic glitters. I guess kind of like the... Um, magical pixie dust this one is kind of like a a grayish with like some subtle purple undertones maybe or this could be just silver and my lighting is just playing tricks on me but maybe it's a little just more like a silver but that is what that looks like and that is absolutely gorgeous I am gonna have to try this one out soon and that does fit and I'm pretty sure these Broadway yeah the Broadway and the Santee will fit in the Eisen Shaker Pro Shaker. This one is kind of like a very muted pale gold type of color and this is called matte gold. And 
And then this next one, ooh. This is like an orange with like a little bit of a coral type of orange. And this one is called SoCal Gal. This one is very pretty. You don't see many orange textured polishes. Although I do believe Zoya has one. Oh, this one's really nice. And this one is called D Blue, which I'm assuming is dark blue. This is like a perfect midnight blue. Oh, and I didn't even realize they have like um, faces on it. They look like from that car cartoon um, Nightmare Before Christmas type of cartoon faces. I don't know if yeah, you can kind of see that. Or it could be just a jack-o'-lantern, but it looks like one of those ones from Nightmare on Christmas, Nightmare Before Christmas or something like that. So this one is just, I'm assuming, dark blue. It's a really nice midnight blue color with silver, sh um, silver shimmer texture, which is different than the first one. The first one had large, chunkier, hollow graphic ones. This one is also all fine gold. And then whew, the next one is a black with gold um, glitters in it, fine glitters. And this one does not have or doesn't appear to have any chunkier pieces. And this is called hmm, Sweet Red. Okay. If they say so. Again, Sweet Red. And it is a black with gold glitter. And then this one, also right up my alley, this is like a deep forest green with gold glitter. And these are all textured. And this is D green, which is, I'm assuming, dark green. It's like that mm, kind of murky dark green. And then this next one is a, um, like a mustard yellow. And this one has larger um, holographic glitters in it. Let's see if you can. There you go, there they are. And this one is called Sunset Grace. Very, very pretty. I can't wait to try these out. And then this next one is more of a yellow gold and this one also has the chunkier holographic glitters in it and this one is called royal privilege and then just to show you the difference in colors royal privilege and um, matte gold That is everything that she sent me. So thank you, thank you, thank you so very much, Adelita. This was so very nice and it's so really great to get um, stuff that I don't have and I've never tried it. So I'm definitely, definitely be looking, um, I guess, for a review for these. And let me know if um, any of you have seen these anywhere and, you know, where you got these from, just in case, you know, someone else might be interested. Um, they might, you might be in an area or just have them available where they're at. So um, thank you again. Um, very, very, very sweet of you to do this. And you really didn't have to, but thank you. And that's it. Let me know if you've tried any of these brands and either of these two brands and what you think of them. Um, or even also the LA Colors. I've never tried these. I don't can't say I really tried any of their polishes. But yeah, so that's it. Thanks for watching. Stay polished at all times and have a great day. Bye.